Pilots. My name is Brittany Thomas. I am a first lieutenant in the South Carolina Air National Guard. I am Captain Mark Wilson from the Texas Air National Guard. I'm Captain Justin uh, J. Hoffman for the Wisconsin Army National Guard. Prior to coming for Capitol Summit, I had a mediocre knowledge about Naga. I, I didn't participate as much. And so once I commissioned and became an officer, then there was a log logistics office, officer association. There were a few other things, weapons and tactics that I've done, but I've never I actually participated with Naga. So this is like my first experience. But this event has really helped to broaden my perspective about everything that Nagus does for the Guard and really for Guard members as a whole. You know, I've had close uh, peers and friends who've gone through it uh, and they, they really raved about the ability to kind of learn the legislative process here at the Nagus Capital Summit. So that's been a, a great boon. It was very much life-changing. Um, just to have the opportunity to come down and understand how the legislative process works, uh, what Nagus does on our behalf as members. I mean, it, it excites you, it galvanizes you, it makes you want to go back to your unit and say, you know, this, this is it. This is one of the premier organizations and they're doing great things on our behalf. I assumed that uh, Capitol Hill was uh, mostly ran by, by older uh, individuals and learning that there is a young, vibrant group out there who's researching and providing uh, data points for those congressmen, whether it's Senate or on the House side. As a you know, first lieutenant in the Guard, I would never get that outside of this opportunity. Nagus and Capitol Summit has helped to facilitate conversations that really help to grow our perspective as CGOs because rather than being at the tactical level, you get more of the strategic overview of the Guard as a whole. It seemed like those we spoke to, uh, that staff was also informed of the desires and the priorities of Nagus, and they were very receptive. They understood, they understood how that impacted their constituencies and the wings um, and the Army bases in, in their state as well. I'm hoping to kind of go back and, and talk with our board of directors at the state level and see what can we do to be more uh, more proactive with not necessarily just the resolutions we send to Nagus, but also resolutions that we do at our state level. Learning the legislative process, I feel like as a younger um, as a younger officer, being able to understand how the authorizations and appropriation process works will really help throughout the career to know how we can affect from the state level what those national level priorities end up being. I would say that it is all of our duties to not just uh, carry on the, the mission and the vision of our Air Force and National Defense Strategy, but as, as part of that, to be our own advocates, to tell our stories, to build those relationships. If you have an opportunity to sign up for Capital Summit, you should absolutely do it.